Hello everyone, Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah with another hot taste. Yes, I don't know how hot this is going to be though. I mean, they're cheese doodles, right? Bye wise. These are cheese doodles, hot and honey. Now they show the little cheesy doodly things on fire. Um, <clears throat> I'm pretty sure that's just for effect though. Hot and honey. So maybe some hot and sweet. I don't know. Let's find out. Cheese doodles, baked puffs, hot and honey cheese flavor. They show some honeycomb. Yeah, I bet no real honeycomb was ever used in this, but it says made with real cheese. Um, but they're poofed. Just extruded and poofed corn stuff that's flavored. Yeah, I'm not going to try to rip that. I'm not, you know, we're not doing that. We're using the Deborah proof packaging fixer there, the skizzers. Okay. I'm not getting hot out of that. Just a little bit of spice. I mean, I can kind of smell it. It's very orange. <laughs> they are very, very orange. Uh, but that's how cheese doodles are supposed to be. So let's see. I mean, they're spicier than cheese doodles, obviously. Already leaving a mess on my hands. They're pretty good. I mean, I don't think they'd even score a one on anybody's hot chart. Hot and honey, no. That's like nut and honey, yeah. They've got a touch of sweetness in the background. A tiny bit of spice up front. Nothing sharp. Um, these are ones that I think the hubby could eat. And he doesn't do spicy stuff. So, yeah. So in this case, don't let the name fool you. If you want to see me eating some really hot stuff, there's a playlist that I have for hot taste. And some of the first things in it are my pepper powder tastings. Where I tasted pepper powders that I got from Jimmy Pickles. And he does uh, seeds. He sells seeds. He doesn't sell the, the powders. Um, but if you taste the powders, you get a taste of what the peppers will taste like if you dry them out and use them that way. And that's an approachable way for people to use hot peppers and stuff. Dry it out, use it in a powder, just use a little on something. Season it with something. Don't just eat a pepper like this. Because <laughs> most people can't do that. Yeah, the pepperheads can do it. I can't do it. But the powders? I mean, don't necessarily do what I did and just put a spoonful on your tongue. Because it's kind of nuts. But I did it anyway. But... Use it to make a seasoning blend. Sprinkle some in your dips when you make a dip. Have that little little something something in there. Because these, you could dip in the dip. They'd be all right. As you eat more and more of these, you get a little bit of re residual heat in your mouth. But it's not anything. It ain't nothing but a thing. Hot and honey. That fire is misleading. They're not that hot at all just a teensy bit of spice and um a little sweetness on the back end i'm not mad at it but just don't expect to have your face blown off by these <clears throat> these are fine for any audience okay there you go fat chick approved just not super spicy and that's okay thank you for coming by and enjoying hot taste with me and hopefully you'll come back really soon and check out my playlist. And uh, we'll see you soon. Bye, y'all.